Hey, good morning, guys. We are actually on a little mini vacation. We call it a staycation. We're actually gonna go to Splish Splash this morning. And a certain birthday girl is excited and cranky because we haven't left yet. Okay. Why are you upset? Because. Because why, we didn't leave yet? Why? Because. Water shoes are good. You're gonna be on water rides. You're not just going to the pool. What? The pink stuff under it. It, it, um, in here, like, here and... Like, it slips out, the sole? Yeah, when, when it's in the water. And any event, this is like such an ordeal. Um, in a good way, because what we like to do is we like to pack as much. You probably heard me say this on previous trips that I've recorded here. Um, we like to bring our own little essentials. And here we got water. Oh. Thermos. Yeah, we have our thermos with our lunch. Dumplings. Yes, they like to have dumplings. So. We try to pack lunch, we eat breakfast before we leave, and then when we get home, we try to just make a dinner or we'll just go out to eat or something like that. But we, we, we are low maintenance here, um, and we just try to be as convenient and um, healthy as possible. So we have fruit, we have water, we have some snacks in here that the kids can kind of munch on in between the rides, right? And our new kitchen. So off we go. We are so excited. <laughs> you excited, Anastasia? But she's not excited. Yeah, she's cranky. cranky oh, she's not happy. Oh, we're only going to Splish Splash. She's been asking to go there for... For like a year. For a year or so. Let me put my seatbelt on before I get in trouble. In any event. So... I know this hair is not gonna last, so I'm gonna have to put this up um, in any event, but it um, should be a fun time. We're actually gonna stop off at to see if we can, because <laughs> the kids have water shoes. I feel like I need water shoes and daddy needs water shoes as well. Um, I just find that it's easier. I like to just put on water shoes because it just kind of gives us a nice little grip when we go on these little, these fun water rides. Mm. And you're walking around more. And yeah, you are walking and around you're more. Just kind of just going in the water and back to your chair, but at these places, it's like a lot of walking. Yeah, and sometimes it gets a little gross. I don't know. Like, you know, it just has a lot of. You don't want to be on your bare feet. Yeah. The concrete and, and, and. It's just not a good time. I have a little dilemma here. So we ended up at Walgreens. Target doesn't have anything, but. My shoe size are like, I have an in-between size and it's a hot mess. So check this out. This is a 910. One of my, one foot is bigger than the other. So this, my toe is right here. Other one, my toe is right here. This is a 910, right? So it's like, this is huge on this side. This like kind of fits just right. Tightened it, should be fine, right? Then there's a 7-8 which is like snug but if it's the left foot <laughs> just fine so i have to figure out which one i want to get i think you should go if that one fits and you don't feel like in a couple hours you're gonna be like this is annoying and it's hurting then you should go with that one if you're concerned which about is that one the, the seven eight because it's snug but sometimes snug shoes can get uncomfortable after a while and you might be at the park and be like miserable right I would go with the 910, but then I don't know if in that room, you know, one shoe fits, the other one doesn't. It's tough. But if you don't feel like that's going to bother you, them being that snug, then I would go with that one. All right, so I'm going to go with a 7-8. I'm going to take my chances. I think it's a better deal because the water kind of expands your feet anyway. It makes it a little looser. I have a coupon, honey, um, so it makes it easier. All right, so story of my life. So here's the deal. Let me show you real quick. So you see I'm not lying. <laughs> so look, if you do this, I'm gonna, sh I'm gonna point down to my feet and I'll show you just how, what I'm talking about. 
So you see the right foot, this toe is longer. And my feet are even in the back. So you see, this is like a size eight or eight and a half. This is more like a nine. <laughs> oh my gosh, isn't that weird? And after having the kids, my size went up and I feel like it kind of shrunk back down a little bit. It's kind of weird. But so I'm going with the 7 8. Let's hope it works. All right, so we are off and uh, hopefully no more hiccups. <laughs> I almost no. got past. Yeah? No, I'm not going to leave him here. Doing? He's going to go cut the strings. Thank goodness. It's a good thing we stopped here. As a matter of fact, a few years ago, a while ago, we took our nephew here to get water shoes because we were taking him to Splish Splash. And that's why I said, you know what? Let's try Walgreens before we go to Target. It's a good thing because Target didn't have our sizes. I called ahead of ahead of going in and I was supposed to get it on Amazon but I completely forgot I mean things got super super crazy so oh man we probably paid a little bit more but I did have a card a little discount so it worked out thanks boo uh, are you guys excited yeah especially to go on the ride that I'm looking forward to Dr. Von Dark's Ride of Terror. I think that's what it's called. It's what a, is that? What is that ride? Um, it's um, it's a purple and black ride over there. And what makes it so special? Um, it just looks super cool. I've never been here before, and I've never gone on there. But I looked at on a map, and that one looked the coolest. To me. Why does it look cool? Um, because like it looks like those colors are like super dark so and i like dark rides <laughs> and mommy's gonna come on with me what do you think yeah you are Hobo i actually went cool. on that ride with my nephew years ago if we're talking about the same one it's that purple ride in the distance i kind of it's pitch black in there <laughs> you can't see anything and you're like going through this dark it's like a dark black like maze. It's super scary, but fun. I'm not the type's gotta have someone. I'm not the type's gotta be in love. I had a lot of people come and go. And plus, anyway, I'm used to being solo. But it was good when you came to me. You were the one to make me believe that life could be better. That we could get by together.
I think we had a good time. Some people, I don't know, not sure about this one here. Anastasia, what do you think? But it's time for dinner, and you ate a bunch of things already. No, I had my pancakes, my lunch, and then a bar. You have grapes in there. Did you have that? Okay, well we have grapes. And then yeah. we're gonna have a nice dinner, we're gonna have a nice dessert. So you're not without. Sure. What was your favorite part today? Going on Dr. Von Dark's That was definitely the icing on the cake. Dr. Von Dark. I mean, it was a slide that's really steep and pitch black. You can't see anything. You have to be at least 48 inches tall and you can't exceed 400 pounds. It's two person per tube. And it was crazy. Anastasia and I went. Couldn't film for obvious reasons. Pitch black. There was a lot of things that we did that we couldn't really get on camera, but you get the idea. It's full of adventure, for sure. Okay guys, so we just left Splish Splash and we had so much fun. And comment down below if you've ever been to Splish Splash and if you have what your favorite ride was. My favorite ride was Dr. Ron Dark's Ride of Terror. So, make sure you guys like and subscribe and comment down below what I just said. <laughs> and, bye guys. Movies all night. We ain't riding on 22s. We saving our money. We saving our money. Man. We be eating ice cream and cake. We going through life like it's our birthday. We ain't riding on 22s. We saving our money. I'm saving our money.
to where I'm going, but I can take you anywhere you know it. Oh, you make me laugh. You like good food. You're from that place. You're from my place.